graph a linear equation using the TI-83 series of calculators. In today's tutorial we'll take a look at graphing a couple of examples of linear equations using the TI-83 series of calculators. And for this first example we're going to graph y is equal to 3x plus 2. So here's the calculator solution. First, remember that when using the calculator to graph equations each equation must be solved for y in terms of x. And we know this based on our equation that it's solved for y in terms of x. So this condition is satisfied. The next thing we do is we enter the equation into the calculator. So we simply hit y equals. And I'm simply going to put in my function 3x plus 2. And notice I'm using this particular x and not this x plus 2. Next we want to graph the equation so we'll simply hit graph. And here we have our line. If your graph doesn't look quite like this to scale it as such you should simply hit zoom you should scroll down to the six option zoom standard and what what this option does is it puts your calculator with the settings negative 10 to positive 10 in increments of 1 for both the x and the y axes and your graph should look as such our next example we want to graph the equation 5x minus y is equal to 9. And here's the calculator solution. Next we want to graph the equation 5x minus y is equal to 9. So let's take a look at the calculator solution. Here again, keep in mind that we must solve our equation for y. So in attempting to solve for y, the first thing we should do is add a negative 5x to both sides. And once we add 5x to the left side, excuse me, once we add a negative 5x to the left side, notice that the variable on the left cancels. Next we'll simplify and our new equation is negative y is equal to negative 5x plus 9. Remember that we want to solve for a positive variable. So here we'll simply multiply both sides by negative 1. And in doing so we will distribute negative 1 on both the left and the right hand sides. And when we simplify our equation we now have y is equal to 5x minus 9. So in the solution continued, we're going to enter the equation into our calculator by entering the y equals. I'm going to simply clear out my old equation and I'm going to put in 5x minus 9. Next we're going to graph the equation by simply pressing graph. And here is the graph for the function y is equal to 5x minus 9. 